Hey guys, Jay and Jared back with some more Pokemon XG. Hey, now he actually triggered the fight. <laughs> so that weird. I somehow skipped last episode unintentionally. It's because you were just clicking through dialogue, man. <laughs> you're playing <laughs> you're playing too fast. You gotta let the game catch up. I mean I just I watched too much GDQ. Yeah, exactly. I caught myself doing that as I usually do after watching a GDQ marathon. What, just like, just like through dialogue? Yeah, just like <laughs> matching through things. I was like, damn it. I actually wanted to pay attention to this story. Fuck. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I did that through like an entire cutscene and then was like... <sighs> and just reloaded and had to fight a boss again. <laughs> like, damn it. And it still wasn't really like hard, but... It was just like a waste of time. Um, but yeah, as I was starting to, to say last time before we stopped, I've really, over time, I've grown to appreciate Gen 5 a lot more. I'm not saying it's bad, it's just the one that I know I've played the least. Yeah. Well, like, I think I've think that played like... through Black once, and then like either Black 2 or White 2, whichever one I bought once. And I don't know that I've actually like gone through and done multiple playthroughs like I normally do. Right. So black and white were okay. Um I know like a big thing that like kind of made me not want to play them <clears throat> multiple times like back when they first came out was like there were so many changes to a lot of like the mechanics and stuff with like experience and like the only way to farm was um to do like Audino hunting. Yeah. Which is annoying. Um but black two, white two, which honestly are really what black and white should have been. Yeah, um, black two and white two were actually really good. Yeah, those are real, real fun games. I might go back and replay that at some point. Although with how many like new games I have on my backlog right now, I don't know if I can justify going back and playing. Like, no, if we're gonna ever, yeah, if we're gonna ever do anything like that, it should be a like a mod like this. Um, or we can do. I know I tried out a couple of them, but there were those. Um, there are Dreyana mods. Like Black two, White two. I think so. Yeah, it's like. Uh, what was it like? I might do that. Bold, bold black and. No, yeah. no, I was thinking. Okay. I know it's something like that. It's something like that. I don't remember the titles. But... Um, but I'm pretty sure they have it for. Two. I know they have it for one, but I'm pretty sure they have it for two. Um, yeah, they, yeah, they definitely do. I've played it before. Um, but there's also because uh, there are a few that I found for um, Diamond and Pearl. <clears throat> nice. And there's one of those that I was playing through. I, I ran into like a couple issues, like it crashed once or twice pretty early in the game. But the real issue that I've run into with that is not having enough Pokeballs to catch everything. <laughs> because I was able to catch... Like they were just hard to catch? or No, just there's so many different things. Oh, okay. Well, I mean, that's not um, necessarily a bad thing. Oh, it's not bad. I was just saying that was like just something that I ran into when I was playing it. But, um... I'm trying to remember. Yeah, I think I got like... I don't know if they had all of the starters from all the generations up to that point, but they definitely had at least one of the starters from each generation within the first, like, couple routes. That's cool. <laughs> um, so I was playing it, and of course I, like, caught all those, and then I ended up with, like, a team of just, like, all starters, and I was like, I really shouldn't do this. <laughs> <laughs> it's just gonna, like... I mean, like, I kind of was just doing it just because I wanted to, like, play through fast and also wanted to, um, see, like, what the trainers and stuff were like. Um, I think I got through, like, the first badge, and I mean, it was pretty good. Um, there were a couple other ones that I didn't test through because there were, like, four different options. I don't think there are any Treano ones for Diamond Pearl, which is why I was looking at, like, several different options, but... I think there were like three or four that had pretty decent ratings on the forums. Nice.
Yeah. Yeah, we can uh we can play through one of those whenever they finally announce the fucking Diamond Pearl remake for Switch. That's definitely going to happen. I hope it happens soon. Well, I want the new game first, and then I want that. I honestly don't even care. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I would still be okay with the Diamond and Pearl remake first, but... I really just... I mean, like, I I do understand, like, the market and everything, but I really wish that that had been what had come out instead of Let's Go. Yeah, that would be nice. I understand why they did it the way they did, but... Yeah. Well, it was a smart marketing decision. I wish it was the other way around. It's also just like so weird that they're just like, nope, only the original 151. It's like, even in Pokemon Go, you can have guys outside of the original 151, so I don't really understand why they... <laughs> yeah, in Pokemon Go, they're up to 4th gen now. Yeah. It was really like, nope, it's 100% a remake of Yellow. Fuck you. <laughs> All you're getting is whatever you can get in Yellow. Well, that way they can do Let's Go the next Gold or like Golden Sun. Oh my god. Like, honestly, if, if whenever they announced Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee, if the reaction had been like way more positive than it was, they probably would have done that. Yeah. <laughs> oh, let's go, uh, Cyndaquil and Hoo Hoo. And, uh... <laughs> let's go Lugia and Hello. And it's like, what? Because they're just like, well, there aren't two iconic Pokemon in the same way, and I'd be like, let's go like Cleffa and Togepi. <laughs> Fuck that. <laughs> it's so bad. At least do like something usable. <laughs> no man, metronome all the way. <laughs> well, I mean, those could be usable. If they gave them all the same kind yeah, of like, OP moves, moves and stats, if they gave yeah. Eevee and Pikachu, you get them, they have like all fucking perfect IVs and fucking 90 power moves of every type. Oh man, I want, uh, let's go Centret and Spinarak. Ooh. That's a good one. Why not like Centret and Hoot Hoot? And then it can be like a day night thing. Yeah, that would actually make more sense. <laughs> I mean, it could be Spinarak and Ladybug. Yeah. That would still be a day-night thing. That would make sense, too. Oh, uh, what about, like, Hoppip? Oh, God, yeah. it's so bad. <laughs> <laughs> um, Hoppip and Sunkern. That would be abysmal. Oh, man. So I kind of want to catch this Tyranitar, but I know I'm not going to use it. I mean, you're not going to use anything. <laughs> yeah, I'm just going to kill it. Um, oh, what else would be good? <clears throat> Do third gen and just let's go Soul Rock and Lunatone. See, those are actually cool. <laughs> I would not be mad about having a Soul Rock or Lunatone as a starter. That'd be pretty cool. Oh, man. <laughs> I'm just going through in my head now, like, for each generation. What yeah, I know, like, what, what, would be. <laughs> what weird arbitrary pairs of Pokemon you can take. Well, because I was thinking third gen, and I was like, oh, like, uh... <laughs> if there were a tree, I'd Bel climb it to get Bel away from all this. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> like, uh, Beldum and Aaron, and then I was like, ah, oh, but there's also, um, Bagon, and I was like, Oh my god, there's so many, like, three-tier guys in third gen. But also, if they didn't let you evolve them, Beldum would be so bad. Take down, take down, take down. <laughs> <laughs> hey man, as long as you take them down. Again, they would just give them those bullshit special moves just for that one Beldum. Yeah. It'd just be so lame to have, like, a Beldum or an Aeron that couldn't evolve. You'd have to let them evolve, then it would be fine. Oh man. Elite Four, Aaron only run. <laughs> I'm pretty sure someone did a either a Caterpie or a Metapod only run in Let's Go. Like I, I'm pretty sure when I was like trolling YouTube for random other shit, like that popped up on a. 
I'm sure on, they like, have. I mean, related the videos. candy the way it is. You yeah, because you just like boost your stats up to like, oh, so if you're level 100 and you're a metapod, then your stats are like 90 oh, no, and everything. And it's like now they're like 300 and everything. <laughs> Back here. I think all we have left is fighting red guy, right? No, oh, there he is. Yeah, Edwino. What is his name? Eldes. Eldis, because he's. Oh wait, never mind. Spoilers. Can't say anything. Penetrated their defenses so deeply. Uh. You see, just like a sweat mark on Eldis's head, and he's just like, um. <laughs> well, he said it, not me. <laughs> I mean, I, I did say it too, but I was reading. It's fine. No, that's what I'm saying. It's like he's standing there and his boss is just like, they've no, penetrated us so deeply. All right, Dad, just... let's fight. Dad? Is that guy supposed to be your father? That's my guess. Wait, so then... Whatever, spoilers. So then, Grievel is your grandfather? <laughs> Probably. That's so weird. Because Elvis is 100% Grievel's son, because he, like, explicitly says that at some point. Does he? Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. It's like after you beat him. Spoiler alert. Again, everyone. Aha, uh -huh, my drizzle activated second. Suck it. Elvis on. walks in and he's like, Father. We have to leave, so you can stop being such a piece of shit. <laughs> Pretty much. Uh, He's like, I'm evil! It's in my name! <laughs> you know, I never noticed that as a kid. <laughs> like, Greedbolt or like, I definitely or noticed that as a kid. I was like, are you fucking kidding me? This is the stupidest name. <laughs> but at least they didn't change that one. It's like the fucking Dr. Evil of Pokemon games, like... <laughs> Pretty much. I mean, I think that's what they were going for. I didn't go to evil medical school to put up with this bullshit. <laughs> it's like one of my favorite lines from that entire series of movies. Shadow Smash, that sounds bad. Ow. Well, it's super effective. His attack though. That's useful. Oh, so it's like hammer arm. Oh. Or no, wait, hammer arm makes your speed fall. Or is it attack? Nah, it's speed. There's some, there's some move that makes your attack fall like that, I think. Just let Zapdos do it. <laughs> I'm trying to paralyze Groudon again. Okay, good luck. Well, I missed the first time. Good luck. It should work, it's a shadow move. I don't care if he's a ground type. Yeah, good luck. I don't know if it'll work, but I feel like it should. I feel like that could work on a ground type anyways because it's not an electric move, because Sunspore works on ground types, right? Uh, yeah, I think you're right. Because so glare. glare is a ghost type move. Yeah, yeah, I think you're right. I was hoping it wouldn't be Shadow. <laughs> the only one of those that, like, even though it's not the type, it still doesn't work, is like poison stuff. Like, you can't use poison powder or whatever on poison types. But you can you can paralyze ground types with non-electric moves. Is poison I think... powder poison type or grass type? It's definitely poison now, but it might have used to be grass, I don't remember. But I know there's other moves that can like poison that I'm pretty sure aren't poison type. Hey, Frost works. Nice. Switch, may as well. Oh, 
Nine Tails is probably gonna die, but it's fine. Can get some damage on Groudon. Man, you didn't even kill it. <clears throat> That's embarrassing. Oh, look, it's Moltres. Haha, dodged. Oh man, and this guy's name's Eldes. Just like how Snaddle and Articuno. Oh wait, that doesn't work. <laughs> I don't see the problem. Snaddle low and Articuno. <laughs> that one letter. Well, at least his attack keeps going down every time he uses this move. Yeah, man, just keep healing. Let him wear himself out. Oh, and his defense went down. Okay, I didn't see that the first time. It didn't happen the first time. It's like superpower. It's like every third time it lowers your defense. Man, that'd be a specific move. <laughs> Let's get Zappers back in here for the rain. And I'm just gonna keep Oh yeah, that's what I was thinking of, superpower. And it's not close combat because it doesn't lower it two stages. So close combat lowers defense and special defense, but not your attack. Yeah. That's what I said. Uh huh. It's, yeah, because it's only one stage instead of two. That, that's, that means the same thing. I don't know why you can't understand what I'm saying. <laughs> My bad. Because he wants to win. Shadow Shake. Oh, nice earthquake. Well, good thing he's at minus three attack. Ah, <laughs> uh, it doesn't affect Moltres. Wait, what? That's a shadow move. It's not ground type. No, it didn't hit Zapdos either. So I guess it is. Whatever. Like Stupid. Um, I'm gonna try and catch Groudon. All right, go for it. Try and catch him. Oh wait, that means that the boss is gonna have like Rayquaza, Rayquaza probably, and like Deoxys and Jirachi yeah, and shit. Fuck. He probably will have like all of them. <laughs> yeah, because what else is left? We've already gone through the legendary birds. I guess there's the legendary dogs. That's and then true. Rayquaza and Deoxys. There is the other Reggie, right? We didn't see Reggie Rock yet. Because Snaddle had Regice and then Gorgon had Registeel. Yeah, I guess we haven't seen it. Unless this guy has it. <laughs> Unless it was earlier in the game and I just forgot about it. But... It's possible because he's very forgettable. Aw oh, man, this only has 3 Gen 3. I was gonna say what if he had, like, fucking Arceus. <laughs> it is a mod. <laughs> yeah, but I don't think they'd have to, like... <laughs> Yeah, they'd have to build the model in and everything, and if they're gonna go through that trouble, they probably would have added other Gen 4 guys. Also, I wonder if my Pokeball automatically failed because he withdrew Groudon. If your what failed? The Pokeball. Because on the same turn that I threw the Pokeball at Groudon, like, it, you know, it, it shook and then immediately popped out. But on that turn, he withdrew Groudon. But I guess throwing the Pokeball goes first. I don't know. That's an interesting... Because, <laughs> like, if it had caught it, what would have happened? The game would have just, like, broken. I mean, it just would have, like, skipped his turn, which would have been withdrawing, I guess. I get. I don't know if it's programmed to handle that. Uh, I mean, I feel like NPCs withdrew in this game originally. Like, not all of them, but I feel like some of them did. Maybe none of them had Shadow Pokemon. Yeah, that's I don't know. Enough. Fucking whatever, man. This is... This is above my pay grade. <laughs> <sighs> Good old Leaf Blade. Wow. Also, I'm really surprised you didn't attack That Swampert. wasn't very effective. <laughs> Why didn't he try and Leaf Blade Swampert? <laughs> it's surprising. 
Because he wanted to kill Zapdos. Also because it was a... Wait, what? How's that super effective? Shadow. Wait, it's Shift Tree and Shadow? What? What are you talking about? He used Leaf Blade on Zapdos, right? Yeah, it wasn't very effective, it was just a crit. God, my brain. <laughs> I was like, wait, how is that super effective? For some reason my brain took not very effective and was like, yeah, it's super effective. Duh. I mean, it has some of the right words. <laughs> it has one of the right words. <laughs> Let's try catching it one more time. I'm almost out of shade balls. Oh no. How can I throw shade now? No. Whatever shall you do. <laughs> Just gonna nope on out of there. Actually, I forgot. His stats aren't lowered anymore because he swapped out and swapped back in. Shit. No, it's fine. He's probably gonna kill me now. I didn't think about that. No, it's fine. Just don't be a oh, it's paralyzed. Wuss. Good. Just stop sucking so much and he won't be able to kill you. Did you ever think of that? No. Well, there you go. Problem solved. And put sunglasses on. <laughs> then it starts playing some random song from The Who. But not like any of the ones that like would make sense and have like a rocky intro, but like a really like B side off the wall thing. <laughs> Alright, last shade ball. This doesn't catch it. I'm done. Why? Just throw your master ball. <laughs> no, we're gonna need that for the last fight. Why? Just let's kill them all. It's, it's a free KO, essentially. Stop being a wuss, man. Why nobody likes you? No. Oh. I know. I talked to your mom. She was like, I'm really disappointed in the fact that Jay is trying to get these free KOs with Master Ball. I was like, I know, right? She would not know what any of those words were. <laughs> Just because she doesn't know what any of those words mean doesn't mean that she didn't say them. <laughs> Just because I haven't talked to your mom in like two years. <laughs> Shit, has it been that long? It's probably been that long. Uh, probably longer. I moved here like two and a half years ago. Yeah, but I feel like I ran into them in Carrollton at some point. No, that I have no like, idea. Before they moved. That's, that's plausible. Ah, you know where Jay's parents used to live. Oh, shit. And don't anymore. So suck it, nerds. <laughs> it's time for this crowd to die. I'm over it. I don't even want it anymore. But it's so much better than Kyogre. <laughs> it's not true. Yeah, it's really not. <laughs> Unless this bullet punch doesn't kill it, <laughs> and then I will consider catching it. <laughs> Is it? Be it like one health essentially. Oh, I clicked iron head. Never mind, it's dead. Everything's fine. Wait, but it's only ground type. I mean, it, it, was, it wasn't super effective or anything. Right. It just has really high defense, so if I use bullet punch it might not kill it, I don't know. Oh yeah, I wasn't sure that Iron Head was going to kill it. You never know. Although Hail probably would have. <laughs> that would have been like the ultimate kick in the pants. 
You're just like, oh yeah, it survived. Hail. Oh, nice. You get to attack it for an extra turn. Thank goodness. Okay, so we are down to just the final boss, I think. Cool. That's good. And yeah, you're definitely down to just the final boss. <laughs> Unless they added in extra trainers, which I feel like they probably wouldn't have done with the fact that they couldn't add in extra Pokemon. I can go back to the healing machine without fighting the boss, right? Yeah. Okay. You're not in the same room as the boss. Oh, right. Yeah, over here. Like, you're in the room with the healing machine. I like how you just, have gives to, us... you just have to put the wall down. Gives advice. If you aim to stop our plan, then you should keep going. Well, because he's a good guy. He doesn't want his dad to be evil, but he's just like, but he's my dad. He's my dad. <laughs> Thanks for lowering the wall. Appreciate it. Hey man, don't talk about the wall. <laughs> oh god, how do I say uh... <laughs> Oh, that's so great because it's like fucking you over personally. <laughs> yeah, not getting paid is not amazing. <laughs> so stupid. What like bullshit rules are these? I'm just like, yeah, well, you know what? Since nobody's gonna give me what I want, I'm just gonna turn the whole government off. It's so dumb that that's like a plausible possible that is allowed. I don't understand. Anyway, on that note, we'll see you next time for the final boss fight. When the wall will finally be completed. <laughs> Bye.